Hello everyone, in this video we are going to talk about calcium, its role and functions in plants and the deficiency diseases, right? So let's start now. This is me, Dr. Anradha Pathak. Now, in which form calcium is being, calcium is absorbed from the soil by the roots, it's calcium ions, Ca plus 2, right? Now, uh, calcium is required by, where is it required, right? In the meristematic and differentiating tissues. Meristematic means the area in which active cell division is taking place in the plant. And differentiating means in which the cells are becoming specialized for different functions, right? Second thing is it accumulates in the old leaves, right? The leaves which are older, they accumulate calcium. So I have two mnemonics for this. Call different Mary. Suppose there are different Mary mams some ladies right and uh, whenever we are in a trouble we call them yeah so call different mary right call old leaves call is for calcium right different is for differentiating tissue maris mary is for meristematic tissue whenever we are in a trouble we call the elder people in our home right so call old leaves yeah leaves is just like yeah, it accumulates in older leaves so call old leaves second thing it is required in the form of calcium pactate, calcium and pectin, right? In cell wall and middle lamella. Now, what is middle lamella? It is the cement between adjacent plant cells. So, suppose this is a plant cell and this is a plant cell. So, outside their cell walls, there is a cement which joins the two cells like uh, cement in between two bricks, right? So, this is middle lamella and it has calcium pectate. Can you see this pectin fibers, yellow threads here? Now, this pectin is also present in the cell wall. Cell wall has cellulose, hemicellulose, pectin and all. But right now, we are not studying that. We are focusing on pectin. Right here also in cell wall and middle lamella. Now, in this diagram, you can see this thread is pectin and calcium bridges between the pectin molecules. It's here in the middle lamella. Pectin is here in the cell wall. Yeah. So, this was all about calcium pectate. Now, this calcium activates different enzymes and it regulates different metabolic activities. Right. Now, it is essential for growth of apical meristem. Apical means apex, right, which is located at the apex of uh, root and shoot here in the plant that meristematic tissue we have studied in the last slide about the meristem it is also required for the functioning of cell membrane normal functioning of cell membranes and in the formation of mitotic spindle uh, we will study spindle in cell division chapter right but here during mitosis a spindle is formed this structure right so for that also it's needed so i have two mnemonics here Call and spin Mary ma'am. Call calcium, spin for spindle formation, Mary for meristems and ma'am is for cell membrane actually, membrane, right? Call middle enzymes of metabolism. Middle is middle lamella and cell wall. Enzyme because it activates different enzymes, metabolism because it regulates different metabolic activities, right? Now, the deficiency diseases which are due to calcium, def deficiency symptoms, right? So, you know that meristem needs calcium. So, if there is no calcium, meristem dies. Death of meristem. Second is chlorosis of younger leaves, leaf curl and necrosis. What is chlorosis? Becoming yellow. Yellowing. Yes. Yellowing of younger leaves. You can write it yellowing of younger leaves. Right. Leaf curl. Leaf curls and dead. necrosis means death. Right. So, see here you can see the leaf has curled. Right. You can see some yellow spots and you can see some dead spots here. Right. These are dead tissues. Necrosis. So, these symptoms in leaf. Chlorosis, curling and necrosis. So, you can remember call young color. Call is for calcium. Right. Call young color. Right. Young is for in young leaves chlorosis occurs first. Right. Due to malformation now what is malformation malformation means 
abnormal shapes will be formed right normal thing will not be formed due to the deficiency of calcium see calcium is needed wherever cell division etc is going on right and due to the deficiency of calcium malformation occurs for example of leaf potato tuber you can see the different size, uh, abnormal shaped leaves here and abnormal shaped potato tuber we know that the edible part of potato is the potato tuber we eat that right now this potato which we eat it is it is a modified stem tuber right now upper one is due to deficiency of calcium and lower ones are normal when there is no calcium deficiency right now last one is blossom and rot of tomato now you can see the tomato here rot you know right and means you can see this hai na so at the lower end see here in this diagram at the lower ends of this fruit rotting is occurring right so blossom and rot of tomato now i have a beautiful mnemonic call young color young color means younger leaves have chlorosis right call means calcium call young color due to malformation what suppose uh, whenever kids are there in our home they uh, definitely do something yeah they malform something or they destroy something like that so you can call call young colors right means young kids due to malformation the blossom ended call young color because due to malformation the blossom ended meristem died leaf curled and died so what what thing happened due to malformation you can make a story that there was there is there was some malformation because of that the blossom has ended the meristem has died and the leaf has curled and died died means necrosis leaf curling and necrosis meristem death meristem dies blossom and rot of tomato blossom ended and malformation right so thanks for coming have a good day